Oh no, the rest of my favorites are on my phone and it's over there. Michael, do you want to pass me my phone, please? Thank you. Problem solved. <laughs> Hi everyone. Today I have a favorites video for you guys because this is the drill. You guys know the drill. We do a favorites video at the end of every month. So I have a couple of bits and bobs to show you guys. So let's start in with makeup first. So the first one is an oldie but a goodie and it is this sleek blush palette. And it is quite well used. It is starting to fall apart a little bit. That's the one thing that I find with all of my sleek products. My mirror always tends to come off. Like, you see that? It's like... But I think it's partially because I've traveled so much with my sleek palettes and I could probably be a little more careful with them. So this palette is exceptionally gorgeous and it has these... Oh, see what I mean? The mirror. There it goes. I'm just gonna lay this here. What I like to do with this palette though is not use them on their own. I find that this one especially is a little too crazy for my face. So what I like to do is mix them all together and create my own little blush color that way and I find it makes such a pretty wearable color. And now to try and get this cover back on. That's gonna be a, a job in itself. <laughs> My next product is a Korean beauty product, actually, and I've heard some amazing things about this from other YouTubers, and it is the foundation by Amore Pacific. Am I saying that right? I think it's Amore Pacific, not Amore. That's like so Italian, that's Amore. No, I think it's just Amore Pacific. As you can tell, I have quite pale skin, and so I got mine in the lightest color, which is 102 Light. Hence the name. What I love about this is that it's so luxurious. The packaging is so fancy schmancy. <laughs> so when you open it up, you get this really awesome mirror. Do you find that sometimes products come with these awful mirrors and you can hardly use them? I don't know. And then it comes with this little sponge and you put your three fingers in here and then the product, the foundation, is underneath this little white seal thing. So the foundation looks like this, and you just take your little puff, and you pat the puff in the foundation, and then you pat it on your face, and it is the nicest formula ever. It gives you a really great coverage, but at the same time, you don't see it on your face. It doesn't cake up like other foundations do. So I am quite impressed with this. My next product is a skincare product, and it has been a necessity for me throughout the month of October. Let me tell you, doesn't this look fancy? <laughs> so this is just your basic body moisturizer. It's by Cetaphil, but what this is really, really, really great for is eczema, or eczema, if you like to call it that. I call it eczema. So I've tried numerous lotions before, and none of them really seem to work to get rid of my eczema. However, I came across this gem, and finally my eczema is starting to go away. It is not completely gone. My arms are definitely the worst. It's so awful, and it gets so itchy. This is TMI. But this has really, really helped, and I'm hoping that this will make it go away forever. So I'll keep you updated on that one. But if you suffer with dry skin in the wintertime like I do, especially now that the weather is starting to get more dry and cold, this will help. And now for some fashion favorites. My first one is a skirt from H&M, and I love it a lot, and it looks like this. What I love about this is that it's kind of like a 70s print. I've really been into 70s style lately, like mixing it with some other modern styles. And this skirt is just so flattering. It has these cute little pockets, so you can put all of your things in there, if you so wish to do. And yes, I got this at H&M, and I just find they've been coming out with so many awesome styles lately. I've really, really been into H&M this month. My next favorite is probably my favorite of all favorites. It's these. I needed a new pair of boots because all of my boots are destroyed. My mom likes to make fun of me because I wear down my shoes faster than anyone she knows. <laughs> and living in Canada, you need a good pair of boots. And I picked these ones up at Topshop. They're quite unlike me. I always, always, always go for brown colored boots. I don't know why, it's just I've always been attracted to brown colored boots. But this time I decided to change it up a bit and go for the black ones. But what I love the most about them is the gold detailing. They have these cool gold bands on the back and little gold zippers and I don't know what this is, details I guess. I've never owned any footwear from Topshop before and I'm 
quite impressed. I love these so much. These will definitely get worn down. So that's all I have for the makeup and fashion. So let's get on into the random favorites. So Michael's sister was really awesome and sent us a bunch of cookbooks this month and as much as I really really want to put all the cookbooks in my favorites, I only tried recipes from one of them. <laughs> and that cookbook is... Oh, she glows! All the recipes that I tried from here were really, really great. And as you can see, I have tabbed all of the future recipes that I will make. So I only have a couple more favorites, and they're all animes. <laughs> and the first one is Attack on Titan. Michael and I have been watching that for the past couple weeks, and I have been loving it. I never thought that it would be something I would love, but... It is the best. What's really awesome about it too is that it's kind of scary, so it's pretty awesome to watch leading up to Halloween. I've just been loving it. Ah, I can't get enough. I only have a couple more episodes left, and I heard there's only one season. Is there only one season? There's only one season. Oh, I'm so sad. And my last favorite, I believe I mentioned in another video before, but I had to bring it up again because I think it's perfect for Halloween, and it is Spirited Away. It's just such a cute movie, but it's also kind of mystical, so it's really awesome to watch this time of year. So if you haven't watched Spirited Away, I highly recommend you go and check it out. Anyway, guys, those are all my favorites for today. It's kind of a short but sweet video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you're not already one of my amazing subscribers, you can become one by clicking that subscribe button right down below this video <laughs> and you can check me out on Facebook Instagram and Twitter anyway guys thank you so much for watching I hope you're having a lovely week and I will see you in my next video bye okay I'm going to do one last picture but Michael sent it to my email he said I wasn't allowed to look at it until <laughs> until I film this video so I'm really excited to see what it is Oh, waiting for it to download. Oh no! <laughs>